Okay, I'm addressing another question I've been getting on the Toyota Corolla 1994 7AFE. How to get the timing belt past the motor mount. Okay, it's pretty easy. First thing you want to do, I have this removed already so you can actually see the bolts. There are three bolts that mount your cruise control. One, two, and three. This is the cruise control here. And what you want to do is just take the cover off, remove those three bolts, and then just move your cruise control out of the way. Then you have four more bolts. You have two 14 millimeters down at the bottom that hold the motor mount. One here and one here. Then you have a 12 millimeter that's here that I already removed that holds the motor mount. There's one more little trick you got to do here and that's remove this little 10 millimeter right here. And I'm just going to take it off and show you how you slide that timing belt across that without taking out your AC or anything else like that. A lot of people are saying you got to disconnect your AC and you do not. You take that one little bolt out, now there's nothing under here. It looks like there is, but there's nothing under here. And if your car has AC, you just lift this up and that belt will come right through here. It's clear all the way across. You do that, once you've re released, removed these uh, mounts, you just jack up your engine um, on the oil pan about an inch. Make sure you protect that oil pan with wood or something between the jack and the oil pan. Jack it up about an inch and you can work this timing belt out through this top part and through this bottom part. Take out the old and slide in the new. Then you just put your bolts back in and you're good to go with finishing up your timing. And that's the little tip for taking that timing belt off without opening up your AC system or removing your AC lines or anything like that. All you have to do is take those few bolts loose, jack the engine up a little bit, move your cruise control all the way, and you're good to go. Now, the other little trick I was going to show you is something I messed up in my last video, kind of messed up, and that is when you release your tensioner, you do not have to fight with that little spring. There's a little spring right here. What I do now is I leave everything intact. I loosen this set screw and the tensioner. And then I push the tensioner all the way back with a bar or and then retighten it with the spring completely pulled like that. That releases the tension on the belt. Then you can take the old belt off. If you want to replace the tensioner, do that and then re-tension this. You put your new belt on and then you release this bolt so that the tensioner snaps onto the belt and, and tensions it. That way you don't have to fight the spring and it's much, much easier. Okay, so I don't want this video to go too long, but I wanted to add those two quick easy tips for the 7AFE 1994 Toyota Corolla 1.8 liter. Alright, good luck. Have fun.